Hello everybody and welcome to Lifeless Planet which is a little pretty cool little game on Xbox One. It was released on PC a while ago actually and um, I've played a bit of it before but I'm going to start again just for YouTube and um, yeah. So it's about an astronaut who goes on a one-way mission to an unknown planet and uh, this is just his adventures. Shut up, because it's a cutscene. Yeah. Very unsettling. Picture of his wife, that's, that's pretty good, yeah. The unknown planet. Boom. So I have played a bit of it, I haven't finished it, but um, it's apparently a very short game, you can finish it in under four hours. But um, anyway, here we are. Oh, my head is killing me. It feels like I have a concussion. Where's my crew? Yeah. So, on a little planet. And you're running on oxygen. Crap, an oxygen leak. I think I said that right. Oh yeah, I don't know if I've told you this. I haven't said that yet, but you have a jetpack, which I'm using right now. Um, you can sort of upgrade it so you can jump a little bit more. But you need to find these special little, uh, little tanks, oxygen tanks, which will increase its duration. But in the meantime, I only jump once until I find another one. And um, you just followed this very weak looking stream of whiteness. See, this game is kind of scary. Your journey will take 15 years. That's right. We'll be traveling so fast, our spacecraft will arrive at the planet before the transmission of this interview does. But it's still such a long trip. We'll be put into a sort of coma. Our heart rate will be slowed dramatically to minimize aging during the flight. How do you prepare for this one way mission, knowing you will never return to Earth? Well, I have a volunteer crew of very skilled and focused individuals. We all have a deep desire to explore, to go somewhere new. And frankly, we also have a few attachments here on Earth. Okay, now I can talk again. So, um, it is kind of scary. It's not a horror game, but it does have some scary elements to it. Like, the whole idea of this pretty much is being on a planet all alone. You can't end yet. Very awesomeness is, says. Oh, there's something right there. Where's my jetpack work? Oh. Well, mostly. Yeah, see, we can. Oh, okay. There is a lot of platforming in this game, just so you guys know. Because it's not much this game could really do. It's, I don't think there's any combat in it. I don't think you can kill anything. As much as I've played, there is no combat in it. Um, just so you guys know. So, I hope you guys didn't think this was some sort of. Uh, I don't know, one where an astronaut has a weapon, killing aliens. Stuff like that, because it's not like that at all. Move that boulder away. Because I need it over there. Damn it. Okay. 
Um, I don't know how long this game will take me to complete. I am hoping about, at the most, 10, maybe 20 Let's Plays, I don't know. Because I, I'm only recording about 11 minutes per episode. And um, again, it goes under 4 hours. You guys do the math, and uh, that's how long it will go for. But... Mm. As you guys know, I'm not very good at completing Let's Play series and there's fishies. I still have to complete Halo 3, and I have plans on doing another Halo. And just to on the topic for Let's Plays, guys, I am not planning on doing Let's Play on Halo 5. I might do some levels, but not a Let's Play, because Halo 5 is a game which I will like to play on my own. It's not one which I would like to worry about completing straight away in for YouTube. And there's a bed right there. I'm gonna get killed by one of these. Yep. You get an achievement for dying in every way possible in this game. And um, when I first played it, I dodged the boulders, but now I got hit by them, so. Yeah, now I dodged them. That was not on purpose. I swear that was not on purpose. Alright. I'll talk. Nah. Okay, here's down for the win. Shoot. It's actually pretty scary, isn't it? You just landed on an unknown planet and you just found signs of Germans? German symbol? I think it's German. I think it's, I think it's German. It might be Russia. I don't know. What are those going good? on here? But signs of human life. Not very good, isn't it? No. Um, anyway, as I was saying about Let's Plays, um, I'm not going to do one on Halo 5. As I said, just maybe one or maybe three uh, campaign missions. But I am not planning on doing a full Let's Play one because that's like my most anticipated game for the year. I am really looking forward to it. And um, if I was to do a Let's Play on it, I'll probably end up worrying about completing the series for YouTube than actually playing it. You, you know what I mean by that. Um, oh, I think that, that's right. There are some puzzles which you need to complete in this game, but they are insanely easy. There's no challenge to it. Oh, okay, that's the code I need to... Yeah. Put in a thing. Is it a house down there somewhere? Eh, it needs a code. I think there's an oxygen thing here somewhere where I can um, increase my jetpack. That's not it. But just. No, it's not it. But, you know, it's it. My mistake, you cannot increase it here. Just so you guys know. Alright, and there's a thing. Mm. Like my new posts on The Simpsons. I haven't really mentioned them. There's Dragon Ball Z up there. A bit higher up. And then you got this little covered thing. It's pretty awesome, huh? There you go, Sally. They were in a hurry to bury the bodies. Alright, now there's a little... A little pretty big... Building. Up there. 